Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Walker's Christmas Dinner for Sprout Lovers. This is a pack of six um, potato chips. Walker's is potato chips like a Lay's. It, they kind of look similar. Uh, Fabian ordered these for us from the British Corner Shop. So thank you very much to Fabian. There are two turkey and stuffing, two Brussels sprout, and two pigs in blankets. So, I think we should try the Brussels sprouts first. <laughs> Here they are. I'm not a huge lover of Brussels sprouts, just to let you know. Okay, another pig. Ah, there's the turkey. Feels like broccoli, to be honest with you. Okay, the calories for it's these. so tiny, there's okay. no way I can read it. It is 126 calories for this bag. Good. It smells like broccoli. Yeah, 120. Ooh, gosh. Mm. <laughs> it's um, very strong. It smells like you're yeah, it's cooked. Strong. It's cooked. It actually tastes better than it smelled, but it still isn't something that I would want to eat. No. We don't generally like green stuff. <laughs> and I don't like some green things. I like I green like things. Um, Those are better than I was expecting them to be. Yeah, they're better than I expected. They, but they, um, they definitely have a very green vegetable. Yeah, color. they taste yes, and they taste like a green cooked vegetable. There used to be something that Mom would cook. Um, it, Brussels sprouts. It was Brussels sprouts because she would boil the heck out of them. And I mean, it seemed like they boiled forever until they would just. Uh, falling into mush on your plate. Um, I don't know how long you're supposed to boil them, but she would. I don't think you were supposed to boil them. Boil the heck out of them. See, um, my mom always made them too like that. And they were always bitter, like a bitter cabbage. Yeah. And, and then I would put enough salt on them to kill a slug. See, I mean, I would. I've always heard, I've heard since then, since I got older, that if your Brussels sprouts are really bitter, then they're, they've cooked, been cooked wrong. Uh, well, then it, I, they're not supposed to be better, but I've had them with other things too. We've gotten mm -hmm. them in like I've, I've had them in like uh, not frozen dinners, but I've had them with meals, right? And um, I still think they're better. So, those those are fun to try, they're good, they're um, not better. We will have to share these with um, with no, Andrew, Andrew and Christina and see what they think. This is the turkey and stuffing, and it's 126 calories, and it smells it smells better. Their stuffing is probably a little different than ours in the UK. I love the seasoning. Mm-hmm. Like a Sunday roast mm -hmm. kind of seasoning. Oh, yes. Can I see that back from Don't throw. Um. Yeah, I I love the uh, the seasoning in here. That's good. I wanted to see what it had. It turkey and stuffing seasoning. That's that's what it's <laughs> literally what it says. And it has Gee, thanks. <laughs> some of the flavorings is like chicken fat. Yeah. It does remind me of like a, a Sunday roast, mm -hmm. kind of. When you make a, a in the crock pot, mm -hmm. your that, chicken. That, uh, when I bake the chicken mm -hmm. in the oven. Yeah. Um, oh, I thought you did in the crock pot. Yeah, I, no, I bake it in the oven. I put all those seasonings. Oh, in yeah, 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 you're right. Yeah. In that big roasting pan. I'm, yeah. thinking, I'm thinking when you do um, uh, roast. Those. In the oven. I could eat all the time because I love that spice. Mm -hmm. It's very good. All right, there's this one. It's not a. Um, it's not garlic no. or onion powder. Um, it's like a, one of those, uh, what do you call the multi seasoning, the all spice? Yeah. It, it has a little bit of everything in it. it nothing does. hot though, nothing no, spicy. No, it's very savory. This is 126 calories too. Pigs in blanket. I'm wondering if this is gonna taste like the bacon rashers. No, no. A pig in blanket is not something I would think of as being um, a Christmas dinner. <laughs> Uh, they do uh, a lot of appetizers and stuff at parties. Oh, really? Yeah, because I've in the magazines, like the Tesco magazine, they where have you that can with pre order. You can pre order things to have for your dinner. I've seen those in there. So, this would be before you eat your dinner. It's party food. That tastes like a bacon rasher. Mm -hmm. That tastes like a bacon rasher. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't have the texture of a bacon rasher. Yeah, you know what I mean? It doesn't have that puffy, crunchy. Mm-hmm. 
Those are my favorite. Those, Those are, are delicious. Good. I love I think those. I like the turkey dressing better. Really? Mm -hmm. I like the turkey dressing a lot, but yeah, these are my favorite just because I love those bacon rashers. I'm neat. crazy about them. I wonder what other one. This one was a sprout, or I'm assuming that the other ones probably have basically the same thing except they replace the sprouts with something else. With something yeah. else? Yeah. yeah, if they came out with different bags of these, then you'll have to let us know what they had. Yeah. Didn't oh, it? well, there's a picture of a red one on there. That is, that's what you got, isn't it? No, that one says Sprout Haters. Oh, well, that'd be me. Wonder what they gave you for if you hate sprouts. It doesn't say on there. It's teeny tiny little writing on there. They still give you pigs and blanket turkey and stuffing, but they give you something else. And I don't know. I can't read it because it's too little. I'm wondering if it's Maybe like cheese. Maybe roast potatoes or because cheese. It's a yellow bag. So I'm wondering if it's like cheese. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, at least they thought about you. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I, I will uh, definitely, if you see these around next year in the United Kingdom, you need to get the pigs in the blanket and the turkey and dressing because those are good. They're good. If you like Brussels sprouts, you're going to like these. They're good. They might make you feel better about eating potato chips, but I personally wouldn't get them. So thank you to Fabian for thinking of us and ordering these things for us from the British Corner Shop. And thanks for watching.